Hello Taurus, thank you for checking out this video. This is going to be your love reading. It'll be for Taurus, Sun, Rising, Venus, and Moon. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. <laughs> so um, this will not resonate with every Taurus out there. So check out your other placements in case there are messages there for you. Spirit, please bring forth messages for Taurus in regards to love. Messages for Taurus in regards to love, please. What does Taurus need to know in love? I've combined two oracle decks here, the Enchanted Map Oracle cards and the Energy Oracle cards. And I, full disclosure, I have taken some cards out of each of these decks. Um, I kind of wanted to just keep the messages clear. So anything that didn't have to do with love or wasn't just clear, um, I took them out to make the deck more manageable. Just letting you guys know. Remember that time is fluid, so this could have already happened, be currently happening, or happen in the near future. And energies could be vice versa. So it could be talking about you or the other person in this reading. Messages for Taurus spirit. Taurus need to know. Balancing act. Interesting. What else do we have for Taurus? be juggling a lot right now in your relationship or something could be off balance thank you hostilities well that's not good hostilities this could be within your relationship outside of your relationship what else for Taurus wow door to romance interesting all right, let's clarify with the tarot. I am using two decks today. Huge thank you to everyone who has commented, subscribed, liked my videos. I really appreciate it. I've been reading all of your comments and I appreciate the support. Thank you so much. Messages for Taurus spirit. What does Taurus need to hear in regards to love? Messages for Taurus, please, in regards to love. High Priestess, okay. What else for Taurus, please? High Priestess, she is secretive. Oh, okay, hold on. That's too many. But I'll take this Three of Cups that came up, up right here. Hmm. Interesting. What else for Taurus? Three of Cups could be reconciliation, reunion, celebration, or third party. We'll have to clarify and see. Thank you. Nine of Pentacles, Three of Swords, another three. Thank you. Oh my God, and another three. Queen of Cups, Three of Pentacles. What is happening, Taurus? Bottom of the deck, the fool. I feel like there's something you don't know you're trying to uncover, you're trying to get to the bottom of something. Some of you could be single, but are in love with someone. That's just for some of you. Others of you had recent heartbreak with the three of swords here. There are three threes here. That cannot be a coincidence. I also have 33 in Door to Romance. Are you guys in a third party situation? Let's clarify, let's see. Spirit, please clarify these messages for Taurus. Love, messages for Taurus. Someone's in love here with the Queen of Cups. Or just vary in their emotions right now. With Door to Romance, I'm really getting there's something new developing here. Could be a reunion of some sort. But something happened with this Three of Swords. Messages for Taurus, regards to love. Messages for Taurus, regards to love. Tell me about the High Priestess. What are you guys not knowing, not speaking about, keeping to yourselves? 
Whoa. Ten of Pentacles. High Priestess bottom of the deck there. Why is the High Priestess here? Thank you. The World. Ten of Pentacles with the High Priestess. Hmm. The ending of a cycle here with the world. For something new to start. Ten of Pentacles. Why is this with the High Priestess? Ten of Pentacles to me is my marriage card. Long-term commitment. But I al almost always think of marriage here. I'm getting the sense that some of you don't know that someone's married. Some of you aren't saying that you're married. Or some of you are wondering if you're going to get married. I mean, but mostly it's the first one for me. But with the world here, I really feel like there, there's an ending here. Have you got, I, I mean, some of you could be thinking about ending a marriage too. What's at the bottom of the deck? The tower. Okay. Definitely could be an ending here of some sort or some sort of reveal with the High Priestess. Tell me about the Three of Cups. Three of Cups is usually, oh my gosh, Three of Swords came out. What? Okay, so I think this is a third party situation. I usually don't like to go there, but I mean, it's very clear here. There's or either a reunion has m broken your heart or have been very painful or a third party situation has been very painful. Five of Cups under the deck. Yeah, definitely loss here. Sadness. Tell me about the Nine of Pentacles. Some of you could be recently single with the Nine of Pentacles. Tell me more about the Nine of Pentacles, please. I have the King of Cups here. Thank you. Four of Swords, King of Cups. Nine of Pentacles. Interesting. With Four of Swords, this is healing energy. I feel like you guys have been healing on your own here. Not speaking. But I also feel like you're still... Almost like... You're... There's a lot of feelings here. You're being emotionally mature with the King of Cups. But there's a lot of feelings here. This could be somebody that's seen their, their opening as well a king of cups energy wanting to make their move the moon under the deck again with this secret unknown doubt tell me about this three of swords for taurus please i see three of swords here spirit with hostilities i feel like there's been fighting page of wands what else for the three of swords spirit for Taurus. Nice is three of swords here. The moon again, eight of pentacles, page of wands. I feel like with the moon, something came to light or is about to. I feel like you're, you've been focusing on yourself, on working on yourself, and then there's this page of wands coming to deliver a passion, passionate type of message. Or there's like an initial spark because again i'm thinking door to romance it's like while you're healing something happens i got the tower at the bottom of the deck this is an unexpected shake-up you, you 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 with the high priestess in the moon you didn't see this coming tell me about the queen of cups whoa it's way too many hold on My cards are all messed up. Tell me about the Queen of Cups for Taurus. It's the Queen of Cups. Okay. Nine of Pentacles again, Six of Swords. Yeah, some of you are definitely leaving a relationship. I feel like you still have emotions for this person, this situation. But you're still walking away here. You are going solo here, is what I'm getting. <laughs> I 
I also feel like with this King of Cups, this could be somebody else that sees you, you know, this partnership with Queen of Cups is very strong. King of Cups and Queen of Cups are very compassionate, loving, giving. I have the sun under the deck here. Tell me about this Three of Pentacles. I think it's crazy that all my threes were at the bottom side of this spread here. Tell me about the Three of Pentacles for Taurus. Spirit, why is this Three of Pentacles? Ten of Cups. Ten of Cups. What else, Spirit, about this Three of Pentacles? Tell me more about this Three of Pentacles, please. For Taurus. Nope. of swords bottom of the deck i have the knight of cups someone definitely coming in to make you this offer here they want to work on something they want to build something here but you are just stuck you feel trapped hmm could be a capricorn that you're dealing with but i'm not seeing it that way However, this, this Knight of Cups is going to make you very happy here. Hmm. Hold on. I'm going to clarify this Six of Swords. Tell me more about this Six of Swords. Normally don't do this, but I'm feeling it. King of Pentacles. You're going towards someone, something more committed, more long-term here. I feel like you were single healing and you've met somebody there's a door to romance here knight of cups page of wands i'm getting something new here with the with the world two of cups bottom of the deck yeah there is a there is something happening better for you i feel like you need to get out of this energy Whatever hostilities you're dealing with, whatever hardships you're dealing with, you're not going to be stuck in that for long. I feel like you're going to move with the Six of Swords. Maybe right now you're shuff you're like juggling a little bit in your life and you can't just leave right away. Um, or someone was juggling two people as well and that has caused problems, as it should. But I definitely see here someone's going to communicate with you the truth will come out here and there will be some sort of union here with the two of cups i don't think you see this right now because again there's this is all tower tower came out twice but i think it's going to give you your ten of cups so i really see this as a positive shake up for you taurus I'm going to leave it there. Thank you so much for checking out this video. If it resonated with you, please let me know down in the comments what this situation is all about. If it didn't resonate with you, that's okay. It just wasn't your reading this time around. Check out your other placements for more messages. Sometimes those can uh, resonate more. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next one.